Hello there, and welcome back to Wonder Boy, where today we're going to be ranking, or well, more accurately, tier listing all 26 letters in the alphabet. They're here in alphabetical order. Our tiers are awesome, great, good, okay, man, bad, and goddamn, I hate you. Do any letters fall under that? Probably not. I'm not really sure, but you know, we're definitely going to find out. Anyway, so I think I'm just going to do one from the start and then one from the end, just because. And let's start with A. I might be a little bit because my name has two A's in it, but honestly, I think overall A is a pretty great letter, you know. It has a nice sound, it is one of the better vowels, you know. A, 10 out of 10, and both of the appearance are pretty good. The lowercase A isn't really that good, honestly. But we're not, you know, we're basing it overall, not like lowercase or higher case. Higher case, that's not what it's called, god damn it. All right, we have B. B is i i like the noise b makes i think both of the b's kind of suck so i'm gonna put it in good if the b just had a better design overall i would probably put it in great but you know b just doesn't have that good of a design if i'm being completely honest i think b's kind of overrated though b does make a very nice sound b is a nice sound all right anyways uh c c c c um I like the C, but I have some problems with C. I'm also going to put you in good. You do look better than B, honestly. Uh, that might be an unpopular opinion. So I'm going to put C in front of B in good. Overall, C is pretty good. You know, it spells that cat, which are not cat, which are not better than dogs. But, you know, they're still pretty good, honestly. I don't know why people hate cats so much. They're not that bad. D, 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 D also goes in good, honestly. It is slightly worse. Actually, it's probably slightly better than B because it's uh, uppercase form, to say so, of D looks a lot better than the uppercase B. E, E's kind of, I, I think E's kind of overrated. It's okay, you know. E is not that good, honestly. Uh, I, I'm sorry, I don't know what to tell you guys. E just isn't that good. It's not that outstanding, to be quite honest with you. Uh, F, F spells fart, and farts are funny. No, they're not, but you know, they can be. I'm gonna put that one in front of E. I still, I, I genuinely think F is a way better letter than E will ever be. G spells some nice word, has a nice sound, and a nice appearance. So honestly, uh, that one goes in great. G, great letter not gonna lie all right we got h h isn't that good and in spanish h is actually completely silent doesn't exist honestly so you know yeah you're probably gonna go in there better than e now nah, i don't know if it's better it does spell hats and hat hat and hats are some of the best words ever so i'm gonna put in front of e the i the i i hate eyes uh this is just a personal thing because i would always confuse i and e so honestly kind of screw you i you're not even that good die in a hole j is also bad honestly j not that good it, it just isn't that good honestly k k is c but cooler like a lot cooler like, you spell cool with a C, right? But then you spell it with a K, and it becomes 10 times cooler. That's so K, easily one of, probably better than A, honestly. K is a, I'm gonna put K in an awesome, honestly. K is an awesome letter, to be quite frank. L, L is not a bad one. I'm probably gonna put that one in front of C. L, not bad, you know? You got lion, llama, Lamborghini, you know? You got great things with L, you know? L, pretty good overall. M, on the other hand, isn't that good. Do I want to put it in meh? Hmm. Uh, I don't know where I want to put M. I think I'm going to just put M here behind the E, honestly. M isn't that good. I do like the sound, mm, but, you know, but besides that. Actually, the more I think about it, the less I like H. H is going into meh. I'm sorry. N. N is M, but worse. So I'm just going to, I'm going to put that behind. I don't think it deserves to be meh. O. O is a great word, honestly. Uh, not word, letter, my bad. O probably goes on awesome, too. O, 10 out of 10. It is beautiful, honestly. Awesome. Just, oh, pretty good. P. P is probably a great letter, too. Probably better than G, honestly. Nah, I think G is slightly better. But, you know, P, not bad. Q, 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 Q. I don't really like Q, honestly. Q. Kind of, I'm gonna put you in man in front of H because I'm starting to dislike H a lot. You might go back down to bad here. I don't know what it is, H, but the more I think about you, the less I like you, even though you spell hat and hats, which are pretty great words. But yeah, Q is just kind of meh, you know, just kind of a thing. 
R. R is one of my favorite letters ever. R is probably, and when I say probably, I mean is better than K, honestly. R, 10 out of 10, honestly. Amazing. S is also awesome. S, beautiful. It makes plurals a lot easier, you know, if they can just be spelled out with an S. 10 out of 10. T, 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 T. T is a pretty great uh, letter too. Probably in front of A, honestly, T. You know, pretty good. 8 out of 10, honestly. U, 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 U. U isn't that good, honestly. There's not much usage for you. There's not much to say about you, U, honestly. I don't, I don't think you deserve to be in map because, like, U is a pretty nice sound. So I'm just gonna... I don't know if I prefer E or U. Mm, ah, this is kind of difficult. I think I'm gonna put you in front of E. I think I prefer you to be. Uh, I mean E. And then V. Um, yeah, V just goes there. You know, we're not gonna talk about it. W, 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 W. Uh, w is nice. I don't like the name W. I wish we could just rename the letter W to something else, honestly. But, you know, whatever. Does that look like a W? That looks like a double V to me. But, you know, whatever. I guess W. Uh, w is actually pretty good. I'd probably put it in front of V. X. X is actually also another awesome letter, honestly. X. Pretty good. Probably better than S, to be honest. Probably better than O, too, honestly. Y. Y. Oh, my God. Y is so good. Amazing, honestly. Y is really, really good. Not gonna lie. And also, I just realized I said I was gonna go from one to here, one to here, but I guess I went in alphabet order instead, so, you know, my bad. Anyways, we got Z here. Z is honestly a... Uh... Is it meh or is it bad? I don't know what to tell you with Z. Z just isn't much. You barely use it. I mean, Z kind of makes a fun noise. Ah, oh, man. I think I'm going to put it in front of here. And then I think I'm going to put N down here. N isn't as good as M. M is definitely superior. So N, you're just going to get demoted to meh, honestly. But yeah, there we go. That's the letter. All 26 letters of ranked or tier listed more accurately. I thought this would take me longer, and I think I thought I would have had less English mess ups in this. But you know, what were you <laughs> what were you expecting, honestly? But yeah, you know, I'm pretty happy. I'm surprised there's more awesome than great. S probably be belongs in great. The more I think about it, but I think I'm gonna leave it in awesome for now. S O X Y K and R are just awesome letters. T A G P are pretty great, and then the rest of them are just good. Except I, because I is honestly bad. J and V just aren't that good, honest. honestly. I like the word vomit. I don't like vomiting, but I like the word vomit itself. Is that a weird thing? That's probably weird. Anyways, guys, have a wonderful day.